Hey guys, what's up? It's Triple S Sports Cards here, and I'm back with another video. So today's video is just going to be really quick. Um, it's pretty specific to um, people in the Chicago area. So if you don't really live in the Chicago area or you don't really um, graph any basketball games, then this video is not really relevant to you. I'm making this video because I got a comment on one of my videos a couple weeks ago um, by Crazy, um, and he asked how to make or how to get autographs at the Sears Center, which is the arena for the Windy City Bulls. So basically, when you enter the arena, you're gonna enter from like somewhere on this side. Uh, yeah, somewhere on this side. Um, you're gonna walk in, and um, if you have seats on this side, you're gonna have to walk all the way around over here, and then you'll enter the seating bowl. Um, but if you wanna get autographs, definitely have seats um, on this side of the arena. So you can just walk in really quick. Uh, the Windy City Bulls bench is right here, and then the visitors bench is right here. So all you have to do is get seats anywhere really on this in this uh, 100 level um, from 114 through 119. Get seats anywhere. Um, you can pretty much just move around. Um, Pre-game, you're going to want to stand um, between 118 and 119. You can walk right down to the barrier between the floor and the stands um, if you want to get visitors autographs. Um, and as they exit the court, they should sign for you. If you want to get Windy City Bulls autographs, just come between 114 and 115 before the, before the game, and uh, they should sign for you as well. Um, post game, um, it's going to be tough to get Windy City Bulls autographs as they exit the court. Um, however, visitors autographs, um, the access is a little bit closer, so normally the visitors will sign post game, um, but Windy City Bulls most of the time do not sign post game. Um, unless one of the players is, like, out doing an interview after everybody else has gone to the locker room. Then sometimes they'll sign. Um, also, some tips for getting autographs there. Um, if you're trying to get Windy City Bulls autographs and you do not get a player before the game, um, two players after every game will be signing autographs um, on the concourse after every game. So... Um, if you come out of this side of the seating bowl and you go up and around um, back here on the concourse, uh, there'll be signs and everything. Um, there'll be two players signing autographs at a table. And at some games, there'll be the whole Windy City Bulls team signing autographs on the court after the game. Um, sometime, most of the times, those uh, full team autograph signings are after like big giveaway nights and stuff or theme jersey nights. But... Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Basically, you just want to get seats anywhere on this side of the 100 level um, and just walk down right here and right here before the game and try and get autographs. So it's not that hard as long as you have uh, seats on this side. Uh, the ushers are really nice. So yeah, that's all we got for today, and I will see you guys in the next video.